Okay, the new fire is here. This is exciting. Kindle fire. Old Kindle. These are a year apart. They look uh, a lot alike. Size is nearly the same. The new Kindle Fire is slightly smaller. That's one of the things I like about it the best. It fits in the palm of my hand. Now, I have a big hand, but it fits perfectly. It works well. The screen is bigger. The function is amazing. I like this a lot. $199. I can't believe the technology that they put into this. It's quite amazing. Now I've had an iPad. I kept it for a while, turned around and sold it because it just wasn't quite enough for me. As far as the technical part, I figured that for that much money I needed a laptop computer, which I got. But now this, for a whole lot less, less than half the price, it's got uh, everything that I want. Web access, YouTube, Facebook, apps, documents, music, movies. The movie, the video is beautiful. I think it uh, may not be an iPad killer from the app point of view because a lot of businesses uh, really get a lot of function out of the iPad. But uh, for my money, <laughs> I like this. I like it. So I recommend a Kindle. I like the old Kindle. I like the way the new Kindle changes uh, pages. You just rub it versus pushing the little button. It may not uh, have some advantages like power. This old one stays uh, juiced up for a long time. They say a month, but it runs for a long time. This thing's going to have to be charged every day, depending on your use, of course. So check it out. But for me, I give it uh, two thumbs up. Big A from Atlanta. Easy Video Guy says, get the fire. <laughs> Thanks. Hey.